Tonight, rebukes and calls to defund San Jose police are intensifying after racist Facebook postings were exposed in recent days. Crowd 4's Rob Flatabo brings us up to speed. I am incredibly disappointed to have learned that local police officers were engaged in vile, horrifying online conduct. Zara Ballou, executive director of the Council on Islamic American Relations, says she is shocked but not surprised that bigoted and anti-Muslim Facebook posts have been linked to current and former San Jose police officers. It's hard to be when we're at a moment in our country when we are continuing to learn about just how deeply entrenched racism is in modern day policing. Baloo says the posts, one of which suggested using hijabs as nooses, calls to mind previous allegations of anti-Muslim sentiment by a Muslim officer who sued the department in 2018. But what this confirms for me is that it may not be safe for someone who looks like me to call them to protect me. In a statement, Police Chief Eddie Garcia said he has no control over what officers post online, but promised to investigate, saying, quote, we have no place for this. No, it's not good enough. Everyone's saying what they're supposed to be saying, but they're not listening to what we've been telling them. Local this NAACP President Jethro Moore reiterated calls to defund the department. Moore suggested the officers implicated in the Facebook posts, one of which reads, Black Lives Don't Matter, may have helped instigate the violence that erupted during racial justice protests in San Jose earlier this month. There is something wrong with the process, the mission of police. It's something that corrupts some of those who were good when they got in. They get in with these good old boys, and it's changing them. In a statement, the San Jose Police Officers Association said the accused officers face possible expulsion from the union and other consequences. Mayor Sam Licardo and the district attorney's office are also investigating. While four officers have been placed on leave, Zara Ballou, for one, says that's not enough. There is no such thing as a secret Facebook group. So how many people look the other way. How many people knew what was going on and didn't say anything? And In so San Jose, Rob Flatabo, Cron 4 News.